Hi everyone, this is Ron Tran with Educational Technology Services here at Denison. Today we're going to cover how to install Google Drive File Stream so you can access any of your Drive files directly on your computer. Odds are you're probably familiar with Google Drive and what File Stream does is basically adds Google Drive as an external hard drive that you can save files to directly without having to go through a browser. This is going to let you edit documents offline or save project files so you can access them on any computer on Denison's campus. So the first thing I'm going to want to do is search for Google Drive File Stream. And I'll click this first link. And there's some documentation about deploying Drive File Stream. And if I scroll down a little bit, I'll be able to download onto a Mac or Windows device. And I can go ahead and click Download Now. So it'll take a minute or two to download, but in the bottom left, I can go ahead and open up the downloader package. So once the package is done installing, I can go ahead and open it up, and it'll take me through this install window where I can go ahead and enter my password. And it'll take a minute or two to write all the files, but once it's done, I can go ahead and click close and I can move this to the trash. So then the applications window is going to pop up and if I open up Google Drive a small icon will appear at the top of your toolbar and I can go ahead and sign in to Google Drive using my Denison account. So now that I'm logged in I'll get this notification at the top saying that Drive File Stream is loading my files and then I'm going to get this welcome window that'll tell me a little bit about what Google Drive file stream is. And I can go ahead and just click through using this arrow. Once I'm done, I can open up my Google Drive folder. And it'll open up a finder window where I can see that my drive and my shared drive are all natively in my computer. So I can also access file stream by going to my desktop. And I have this icon here, and if I click on it, then it'll open up that Finder window, and I'll have access to all of my Google Drive files. So thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to the service desk at denison.edu.